I did it again. No oops, by the way, because I did this on purpose. Yes, I was so blown away by Coach the first time. And I'm like, okay, Coach. I see you doing your thing, but I went back and not only did I buy one bag, mm -mm, I bought two bags, yes. So we're about to see the different colors that I got, do a comparison, see what fits inside, all the deets. So if you want to see, you have to stay tuned. Hi, and welcome to my channel, Simply Fabulux, where I'll talk about luxury goods, items, a little bit of lifestyle, and I'll probably sprinkle in a little bit of tips or advice that I've learned to share with you. Okay, so if you haven't seen the last video I did about Coach, because I haven't been there in a while, but now that I've had this Coach bag that I bought, I have been blown away. The quality, the style, like Coach is really upping their game. I don't know who the creative director is over there, like what's going on, but you got my attention because I actually went back to Coach to get more, to get more of the same bag because you know a girl loves her tiny bags. Yes, tiny bags all around, everything. I love it and I went back. But before we get into today's video and I do all the specs, the unboxing of my new coach bags, I'm gonna ask you to go ahead and like this video, subscribe to the channel, and also hit that notification bell so you can stay informed when I drop a new video because I drop a video every week. Now let's get into today's video. Okay. As I said, I went to coach and this particular time, the colors that I wanted were not in store. They were only available online. And I don't know why I didn't even think about even trying one of my favorite stores. You know, Coach is really available, not only at Coach. So if there's like not a Coach near you, you can also buy Coach like at Nordstrom, at Dillard's, Macy's. I want to say maybe even Neiman Marcus I saw it there as well, like online. I'm not sure in the store, but like definitely online. Cause when I go to Nordstrom, they have so many bag selections. So I'm normally not always seeing the coach section, at least where I walk into, like I walk into like my Nordstrom and like there's Ferragamo and that always gets me every time. I'm just like, ooh, look at these Ferragamo bags. But anyways, the point is, coach is sold at many outlets other than just coach stores. So knowing this now, some of these stores actually carry colors that might be sold out at Coach. Like say you wanna to go to Coach and like for this particular bag, I wanted pink. They didn't have pink. You know, pink is one of the colors that I really do like. I'm getting more into. And I was like, oh, I really didn't want pink. But I got the black bag originally love the black bag like the quality the craftsmanship like i don't know what's going on at coach like i said i haven't shopped there in a long time i remember coach like as a kid like junior high maybe a little bit of high school but not as an adult you know so i think bag has kind of fell off on coach but recently coach has been in my feed coach has just been everywhere i'm just like okay coach I see what you're doing. Like, I really like the bags that are a coach. But you know me, I'm a girl that likes tiny bags. Yes, small bags are my thing. And Coach has some really nice ones, but the one that I'm talking about in particular is the Joni bag. Every designer is doing a crescent style bag, but the size that I want in particular is like a small bag, a tiny bag. And the only other brand that I was just known for sure that I liked their tiny crescent bags was Fendi. So yes, Fendi has these beautiful nano Fendi graphy bags that I love. They're little crescent moon shaped bags that you kind of just wear a top handle or wear as a wristlet. Not much fits in there, but still love it. But the price for it was just like, ugh, I don't know. Especially when I like multiple colors, okay? So it's like, ugh, I'm buying it at a high price point. I'm glad we're gonna stick to one. But then when Coach, when Coach came out with their collection and they introduced a new color scheme, you know it got my attention. And not only was I able to find 
a color that I liked, their new color that they just released. I found the old color that they released when they originally released like this line of bags. So yes, not only did I get one, I got two. They're both in pink. No shame in my game because I'm a girl who likes pink and I'm going to admit it now. I used to like shy away from saying I like pink. Well, just because I'm a girl doesn't mean I automatically like pink, but I just happen to like pink and I'm not ashamed of saying that now. I've come out the closet and proudly say I like pink bags, pink items, pink things. Now, I'm not gonna go kind of too crazy where everything is pink, but just one of the colors that I happen to like is pink and both of the bags that I picked up were pink. So it's gonna be a little bit of pink overload today. So if you're a person who likes pink, oh, this, this is a video for you. So let's get the first one now. Again, I said I bought this online. So the online experience is a bit different Plus I bought it from Nordstrom. Although I bought these bags at the same time, they came like at different times. So one came directly from Coach. It was one of the newer colors in the collection. And then the other one was, again, I just found the last one of that original pink that came out when they introduced the Joni bag. I hope I'm saying this correctly. It's the crescent shaped tiny bag that I'm talking about. The new color that they introduced recently is called Dragon Fruit. So yes, like I said, I bought it online. So the experience of buying it in the boutique and then buying it online is different, but I thought because the first one I got, although I bought it from Nordstrom, but it came directly from Coach itself, that I'd have, you know, like kind of the same unboxing experience. Like if I bought it from a Coach, boutique directly but no the bag came in a box like a brown box but then like this so i haven't opened it i have not unboxed it. i just literally took it out of the brown box that you know nordstrom ships their items in and this was in there just like this packed just like this so this is going to be a true unboxing for both of the bags now this one was actually packaged really nicely the other one i believe it maybe was on the floor or something because it was definitely the last one in Nordstrom like the last one I could find online and I really did scour the internet looking at different stores I did see some like at Poshmark or you know some that were already like pre-loved but I was looking for like a new bag we're gonna get into that one second but we're gonna open this one first again this is the dragon fruit color you can't really see it but you can kind of see it's like a pinky ready just a deep pink color bag but all right let's open it and it is giving a lot of like barbie vibes like this definitely would have been a great bag for coach to release last year you know if they were going to release this bag because you know there was such barbie fever that this bag would have been great to have with your outfit when you want to go see barbie if you're one of those people who got dressed up to go see barbie and wore like their favorite Barbie inspired outfit. This bag would have been great. Let's go ahead and get this out of this styrofoam. Here is the strap right here that's encased in styrofoam. So now we can already see this beautiful dragon fruit color. I really hope the color pigment like picks up and you can see how this is just a beautiful leather bag. Let me unwrap it some more. So now that I have it all unwrapped, I took all the little foam paper stuff. I think I still have the tag on. But just so you can see this beautiful, gorgeous, and this is that glove, genuine glove tanned leather. I love the quality. The feel of the bag is very soft. It's supple. Like right now it's stuffed to capacity so it doesn't get any like fine crinkles because this is one of those bags I can tell over time with love with use it will get wrinkly a bit because it's it's leather you know it's like that soft buttery leather that like doesn't hold its shape unless you put stuff in it it's not that stiff leather I can definitely tell that so that's why it's stuffed to capacity and it's probably how I'm going to store the bag with the stuffing inside because that will definitely hold the shape but yeah it does have the silver hardware it has this little luggage coach tag if you want to keep that on there you don't you can definitely take it off and i know you can also get this monogram so you can go to a coach store if there is one by you here is let me just fasten this so you can see what it looks like because 
when you start to like put it more in that like crescent really tight shape you do kind of start to see where it puckers on the leather a bit which is why i say you know if this is not feels like it is right now you'll probably get a little bit more of the you know dimpling wrinkling of the leather because again it's genuine leather i love the detail i love this it does yeah i think it's like silver hardware on top on um, the zipper as well on the side that's holding the little luggage tag on the d-rings because you can put on a strap i didn't take the strap out the foam or the <laughs> paper just yet but yes it does have a strap they all have straps with them which is what i enjoy but you know i like to carry my bags mainly like this or like this or if it's it's not like tight enough to be like a tight wrist maybe because my wrist is not it's not this big <laughs> i guess if i have like a bigger wrist then it'll be a great you know wristlet bag but yeah just kind of holding it like this or holding it like this you definitely can i know i definitely would just hold it like this or if i'm having like something else in my hand and i'll put my arm through the hole just so i can use both hands if i need to but if i can i'm just gonna hold it like this i feel like the other color is a more everyday color so it doesn't matter what you have on you can wear it this is more vibrant color so like maybe if you want to do a little bit more matchy match or maybe you want this to just really a standout piece when you're wearing your outfit or however you want it i just know I probably wouldn't wear this more every day, just you know, when I'm in the mood. I don't necessarily have to match my bag to my outfit. If this is the bag that I want to wear, I'm probably gonna rock it. You know, that's just me. And I'm gonna rock it just like this. Again, top handle, so that's why I'm not gonna actually attach the straps and like unwrap it. But the straps are in the same color as the leather. It's also the gloved tan leather as well and then i will show you what fits inside but before we get into what fits inside the dimensions and all that stuff i'm going to go on to the next bag i told you i got two bags from coach okay this one and another pink let me get that one here is the other bag it came in just like this in a brown box from nordstrom so i'm just glad i was able to get it because i literally loved the color when i saw it online I'm happy that I was able to find it. So here's the strap. It's not wrapped in plastic, so you can see it's the same color as the leather of the bag. And here is the bag. Again, same bag. This is more of like a softer bubblegum, light pastel pink, which I really like as well. And again, it does have silver hardware. So here it has the silver hardware as well as a little zipper pull that has the C on it for coach and then around the D-rings it's silver and then like for this little luggage tag or dog tag whatever this tag is called there's also silver around you know what's holding it onto the bag so yeah I like a nice silver moment I'm a girl who likes silver white gold platinum I have no problem you know getting this bag with this color hardware. I know someone mentioned like it would be really pretty in gold. I mean, I agree, but I feel like I, I can wear it with more things just because I have a lot more silver. So, or like white gold items. I do like a side by side comparison so you can see the two colors together. So here are the two colors. And I'm trying to see what name of this pink is. So this one is called Vivid Pink. And then this one is called Dragon Fruit. Let me see, yeah. This one is called Dragon Fruit. This one is Vivid Pink. So you can see same bag style, same size, different colors. This color came out when the line was released of these small Joni bags. So they released this in black, Vivid Pink, like a nice pistachio green, a lilac, which is like a light pastel purple, and like a nice creamy, beigey white color and that was the only bag out of all of them the creamy white one that had gold hardware everything else had this nice silver hardware and then this is the newest drop that i've seen i think they have more colors but for pink that you know intrigued me this was it this was the dragon fruit color and when i found this color i just happened just to see like i wonder if they have vivid pink 
and they did. So I'm glad I got it. Again, I got this from Nordstrom. All the details about, you know, price and everything will be in the description below. So if you're just wondering, oh, do they have any more bags? I will definitely link it below if not coach or at least other stores that carry this bag. You don't just have to go to coach, which I didn't know. I didn't even know that other stores. I mean, not that I didn't know. I think I forgot because I feel like I've always seen coach carried at Macy's, but I didn't even think about Dillard's or like Nordstrom or Neiman's or even just looking at other, you know, department stores that carry, you know, name brands. Let's see what fits inside the bag. I have my other bag here that I was using today. So we're gonna like, you're gonna see what I carry when I carry my mini bags or my tiny bags. So let's first open this bag and get all the beautiful stuffing out. Now I can tell you because I have tried already that a phone will not fit in here. Unless you have one of those like small flip phones that Samsung has, like the one that folds, that might fit in here. I don't know, I can't say that I've tried it, but I feel like because that's smaller, especially when it gets folded it gets a little bit more compact that might fit in here because like I said my phone won't fit in here but I will show you what does fit in here or at least transfer the items oh this one has a lot of stuffing <laughs> let's try the other bag this cup this has so much stuffing in it okay this has less stuffing in it so it's easier to take everything out and then again it's just stuffing in here so I'm just gonna take it out so we can see what fits inside just to show you again, a phone does not fit. I have my phone next to me. Here is my phone, so I'm gonna show you that <laughs> it does not fit in here. Like, yeah. So definitely if you get this bag, just be prepared. If you're a person that has to have a bag that fits their phone, and I have an Android, which is usually a smaller phone. Like I usually see people with their iPhones and it never fits in their small bags. And this one always fits in like, about 90% of my small bags, um, but except for, you know, this one, it does not fit. Even when I try to put it to the side, yeah, I really can't even maneuver it to get it to the side. It's just, it won't fit, yeah. It won't fit standing up, it won't fit if you try to maneuver it. It's just, yeah, it's just way too big for the bag. But I will show you, cause I, can, I had another tiny bag that I wore today. I'll just do a transfer of like what I carry when I carry my small bags. I don't carry a lot. Now, the only thing I don't have in my small bag with me that I normally carry is my key fob because my key fob will be in here, but I usually leave that by the door so I remember to take it when I'm walking out. So yeah, that's the only thing that I know will definitely fit in here. So that will be in here. If you don't know by now, I love a good lip gloss. So, you know, I have these two lip glosses that I really love from Huda Beauty and from Rare Beauty. So. We're gonna put that in the bag. It definitely fits in the bag. I always carry like my little wallet. All right, this has my ID, form of payments, you know, all the good stuff goes in here and this will fit in here with the lip glosses. And then I also carry a perfume sample. And this is one of my favorite perfumes that I love, which is the Symphony by Louis Vuitton. So I carry that and I put that in my small bag. I get lots of compliments when I wear this. So yeah, this fits in here. All right, so now the true test is to zip it up and then latch it. So zipped up, everything fits in here. There's still space for my keys. So my key fob will be in here. I usually have two sets of key fobs, so that <laughs> will go in my bag. And then the true test, because sometimes this won't do if you put overstuff it. And it does, it works out. So yes, I just transferred everything from my other mini bag <laughs> to this bag. This is what I wore today, actually. And I just put everything in here. That's what fits in this bag. Again, not the phone, but I'm glad I can carry my phone in my hand, put it in my back pocket if I need to. And everything else that I need is right inside of my bag. I do have to apologize because I didn't say in the beginning, in the beginning of this video that I am getting over a cold. I don't know how you even get a cold in the summer, but I got it. I got a cold, getting over it. So my voice is still a little raspy. I didn't do like little pauses because I was just coughing. All right. Although I'm like, 
95% you know of the way fully recovered but yeah I I was I got a cold and it it knocked me out for a few days you know it's not fun get chicken noodle soup or eat hot soups during the summer because you want to stay cool maybe like a nice gazpacho or something but um yeah I was advised don't take anything that's acidic I was like maybe like a nice tomato soup they're like no that's too acidic get some chicken noodle soup get other soups so you can you know get over the cold so that was the sad part even though i feel like i still kind of feel like you could have some tomato soup when you're sick but you know y'all let me know because i was told like don't have something like that it's just too acidic but i like a nice tomato soup when it's cold you don't feel well with a nice little grilled cheese sandwich let me know am i the only one who doesn't mind eating a nice tomato soup with some like grilled cheese a little bit basil some cheese you know okay all right so i am getting over the cold so my voice is still a little raspy it's not quite there i kind of like it some people are just not a fan of their own voices i know i'm that person who's just like oh i don't like hearing my voice all the time but anyways yes i'm getting over the cold but again i just want to say thank you for watching this video you know what leave a comment below let me know which bag do you like do you like the vivid pink the dragon fruit maybe the black one that i have or maybe none of them or maybe there's another color that you saw i think there's like a denim color that came out or denim i think by coach it's like i'm being reintroduced to coach i'm like seeing more stuff and then like the price point i'm loving especially when you're like comparing it to something that's thousands of dollars and this is just a couple hundred of dollars it's still money it's still pricey i'm not saying it's like cheap or anything but i am saying it's just compared to something that's thousands of dollars and then you're like oh it's just you know a couple hundred of dollars you feel a little less guilty I'm not saying that the guiltiness is not still there when you know you're buying stuff and you're like uh should i be buying two should i be buying three but i still feel like even with the three bags that i got it's still not equivalent to the price of the one bag of the other brand that i love that brand okay i'm not gonna like bash it or anything i do love it but it's just like uh, if you're trying to look for another alternative selection to a bag and you're just like i'm not at that price point yet i can save up maybe 200 dollars to get a bag yes and then they be having sales even though the last sale that i went to these bags specifically were not on sale i'm like so y'all have everything else that's 40 percent off 20 percent off but this wasn't but i have a feeling i have a feeling and they still have some in stock which i think they will buy like black friday they'll be on sale i know so if you're just like uh oh, it's 200 still a lot if you can wait till black friday if you can wait till then i really feel like these might go on sale. i don't know how much but i just have a feeling because coach would love to do a nice sale all right so i can see these going on sale but anyways yeah so and i will put all the details below let me know what you think let me know which bag you like again coach has got my attention i don't know who is in charge there right now but they are doing their thing okay i'm loving it i'm like peeping over to see what else they have you know not that i need any more bags but sometimes it's just like i honestly i i can't say that i am at purse peace with coach like this is all i need these three bags that i have i'm i'm at peace i don't need any more bags but y'all be having me because i'll be like ooh, what is that no no don't don't be looking because you know you're gonna want to buy so yeah i'm good for now i'm very content i like these two colors that i just recently got again leave a comment below let me know what you think and again don't forget to like this video subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you can stay notified when i drop a new video again thank you so much for watching thank you for your lovely comments y'all are all like just really beautiful kind humans i love it and again i just want to thank you for watching thank you for being part of the community i cannot wait to see you in the next video have a good one bye